Hi, I'm h i j i n u and this is today's leadership lesson. Every organization is faced with leadership succession at some point. Leadership succession is a great opportunity to stimulate organizational change. However, this succession often can create a turbulent transitional period. Today, I'm going to give three tips to help senior business leaders to smoothly assume the head of a business. So, here are the three tips for smooth leadership lesson. Number one, you have to think about interdependency in your organization. Your business is a system, not a simple plug and play device. Most activities in organizations are interdependent, so if you change one part of the system, the impact is not limited to just that part, but it could impact other areas as well. When you become a leader, it is tempting to discover problems and immediately try to fix them right away. This is a temptation that I must caution leaders to avoid. Because every change can be linked to other processes, and like a chain, once one link is broken, the chain won't work anymore. So leaders, you must carefully consider the consequences of any change and prepare for possible confusion in the organization. Number two, you must learn to handle uncertainty. You have to understand that you as a new reader are a stranger to people around you. They don't know you yet and they have no reason yet to trust you. They have to deal with uncertainty about you. And uncertainty always creates a state of tension. It is your role to reduce this uncertainty in your organization. To reduce this uncertainty, you need to thoroughly communicate with your stakeholders, be open to feedback, both formal and informal, on your leadership style and strategic directions. If you and members of your new organization are not on the same page, it will be very difficult to drive your organization on the way that you want to lead. Finally, the third tip for succession is to build trust by respecting the past. Oftentimes, new readers, particularly who are brought from outside, ask, why did you have this policy? Why did you run things this way? You need to be very careful when you point out the problem of the past regime. Your disrespectful attitude can seriously demoralize your colleagues who have been with your company. You have to build a foundation for trust from them. You need to show respect and appreciation for what was done prior to your joining the organization. So, today I have given you three tips for improving leadership succession. Think about interdependency, manage uncertainty, respect the past. I'm Hijinu, and this has been today's leadership lesson.